Today I'm going to be making a quick and easy fish dinner. I'm using uh, Rainforest Seafood White Fish Filet. And I'm just basically going to be doing this meal with about maybe four or five ingredients. Quick and easy, right? So sometimes, you know, you're just not in the mood for the forever preparation and all of that shebang. And this is going to be a perfect meal for the summertime because of how quickly it is done and also the fact that it is going to be very light and hearty okay so stay tuned and let's go through this all right guys so i have a measuring cup here to which i have added some minced garlic some minced ginger and some red pepper flakes as well as some olive oil i'm going to add about a third cup of uh, soy sauce to this mixture as well as i'm going to add about equal portion of honey to make a marinade okay so we have our honey that I have poured into our jar so this marinade is what we're going to be putting over the fish and allowing it to remain there for about 30 minutes before popping it into the oven all right people so here I have my uh, fish fillet pieces they have been washed in lemon water of course and now I'm going to be adding just some salt we know how this works all right you can't have fish and it's not cooked with salt fresh fish don't work well all right but we don't want to overdo the salt as well now if you know anything about me it doesn't matter what marinade i'm going to be putting on my meat i always like to go in with my own seasoning and i do have now some black pepper that i'm adding to the mix now you don't remember that i added some ginger to the marinade just adding a little bit of ginger powder here to this and a little bit of uh, garlic powder also you know just to make sure that at the end of the day everything is nicely incorporated and that the fish will have this depth of flavor and i'm also going in with a little bit of um creole black and seasoned uh blend all right not too much that's it fish doesn't need a lot of seasoning on it and um one last ingredient just to give it that depth of flavor i'm going in with some Thyme. All right, so I'm gonna be adding that now. Just a little bit of um, uh oh, a little bit of thyme to the mix. All right, so we're gonna rub this around, massage it a little bit, and then I'm gonna show you the next step. So as you can see, we have our fish fillet that has been nicely um, seasoned and coated. And the next step now is for me to add this lovely marinade mixture into a freezer bag to allow the fish to marinate. So I'm just gonna pour a little bit of the mixture here into the bag and then add the fish. All right, the mixture is in. Now it's just time for me to add the fish pieces. We're gonna have this marinade legit for 30 minutes 20 minutes have passed our fish is fully marinated and i have plated it not plated it i have placed it rather on a baking tray with wax paper of course because i don't want it to stick and if you notice i have lined the four corners with um just bits and pieces of lemon lime why you know you just want to ensure that that scent that you would normally get from the fish is not too overpowering in the kitchen or in the oven right so the best thing to do is to put a piece of lemon in there i'm gonna pop this in the oven now for about 20 minutes after which i will show you the finished product all right guys there you have it the finished product and this is our honey ginger garlic fish fillet white fish fillet served up with uh some spanish rice and some string beans and of course i have a little bit of lime on the side so you can always you know drizzle that on your fish watch nice there's no doubt that this is going to be really good like really tasty 
you know if you look at all of that roasted tomatoes and roasted bell peppers that's placed into the spanish rice there's a little bit of noodles in it as well pasta that is Ooh, look at the string bean Ooh, guys this is goodness fish is topped with a little bit of uh, sesame seed my host festive bad very nice light and easy and hearty sunday dinner bon appetit thank you so much for watching